Greetings, New Life family. We want to send our love to our church home and family back in California. This is Andy, Christina, and little Ellie here standing in front of the church building for our home chapel. Recently this year, the beginning of this year, the Thai pastor here had to be removed and the senior missionary Kelly Hildebrand stepped in and just this month he's asked us to come and help this church. So we've come back to the church where we served our first three years, seeing God already move people out from the church we planted to plant new churches. We see one door closing and another door opening. So we're excited to be back at this place on the street where we used to live and serving with the people that we've grown to love over the years that we've been here. And as we stand here, you can see the wall behind us that's being built for the coming flood. Ordinarily, Thailand has a lot of rain come during the rainy season, from May to October. And this year, it was normal up until August. And then in September, we were dumped on with five times the normal rain. And the rain has slowly worked its way down from the dams and the hills, through the rivers and tributaries, and now is surrounding the city of Bangkok. A recent map we looked at just showed massive amounts of water all around the city waiting to come in. So we've been waiting for days and weeks, pretty much a whole month that we've been preparing food at our house for the coming flood that the government's fighting to keep out of Bangkok. And just this morning we woke up and looked out our window and saw the flood waters getting close to our condo, just down the road at the, at the nearest intersection. So we've been preparing, the city's been preparing, and this church has been preparing. Maybe it will stay dry like it is now, or maybe the waters will come up to this wall. But we're praying, and uh, as you keep praying for the people in this church and the city, that God would keep them safe and keep the flood minimal. But there are people that are uh, members of this church and other people in the city and outside the city that are dealing with flood waters in their homes. One of our members has had water waist deep in the first floor of his home for over two weeks as he stayed with his family in the second floor, staying in their home to protect it from potential burglars if they left to go to the evacuation center. The other great thing this church has been doing has been pitching in and supporting the local evacuation center down the street. There's a massive evacuation center that prepares food and resources for many of the other centers, relief centers. And uh, they've got people in this church going down to participate with the other volunteers preparing food and supplies and they've been going every day working with the people there. So we're doing everything we can in this time to touch people with the love of Jesus and, and be a light in this dark time. Pray that God would shine in this time and this church would rise to the occasion and be a blessing to this community and to this city. We love you and we can't wait to see you in person again but we wanted to send a video greeting letting you know the new things that are happening in our life and the concerns going on here in Bangkok.